Welcome back to the Dry Pass Podcast. I am Isaiah, and tonight is May 22nd, marking the end of day number six. I am grateful to Yahweh and Yahweh Shai for making this fast possible, and Lord willing, I will reach day 10. The focus of this fast is thanking Yahweh and Yahweh Shai for the great things they have promised and prepared for our nation that we call Yasharala in our Hebrew tongue. I slept only a few hours last night and woke up feeling somewhat similar to yesterday, just a little worse. So a slow downward trend, but still very much functional today, minus the voice. The rending pain in my back is much more intense today. Uh, It's along my upper spine as well as in my lung and heart area. Both today and yesterday, upon waking up, I sneezed a lot, which is usually indicative of liver congestion clearing. Along with that, I have an increasingly very painful sensation that feels like a huge stuck bile stone towards the back of the liver. And thus, I'm considering focusing more on liver flushing than fasting in the future. Related to that, towards the evening, I noticed my intense red eyes coming back, and I'm starting just to spit a lot again. It just, again, it just feels like that's what my body wants me to do. So I'm starting to suspect that I am reaching my limit in terms of the amount of cleaning that my body can do by virtue of now having what I believe to be an overloaded liver. That or it just needs a little more time to deal with this liver blockage and then I will be fine. I'm not really sure which and obviously I have to make a decision at some point. Otherwise, I spent most of the day outside in the warm sun which felt great and it's very important to be outside in nature, with your bare feet on the ground, especially in longer dry fasts. Boredom is less of a factor on this fast, which is great, and it confirms my previous suspicion that the term boredom is really just a clever way to hide the underlying demonic nature of that feeling, such that for me, the last fast greatly weakened those types of demons that are on me. The intrusive thoughts that I do have pretty much only come at night this time around, and they do keep me from sleeping until anywhere from 12 a.m. to 3 a.m. The other time they showed up was twice, once yesterday and once today, briefly, and it was when I was in the vicinity of hydrogen peroxide. I got this sudden feeling of intense urgency to rinse my mouth out with the hydrogen peroxide, which I can't do, obviously, during the dry fast. My voice is starting to go now, which is a day later than last time, and I attribute that to a really good foundation having been laid during the prior fast. I weigh 147 pounds today. I was 150 pounds yesterday, which denotes a three-pound change. So weight-wise, I am tracking pretty much per usual, and this is fairly consistent from fast to fast. I pray that sharing this experience is helpful to you, and I'm grateful to be able to share it. I'm glad that you're taking the time to listen, and you're more than welcome to contact me with any questions. May the Most High Yahweh and Yahweh Shai bless you and continue to guide you to greater levels of faith. Thank you for joining me on the Drive Pass podcast, and I'll speak with you in next one.